Hi guys, it's Sofer here. I'm going to show you something about node creators that not many builders may actually know. It's really quite simple and easy to understand, but you have to see it before you can realize what the potential of this little trick is. What we're going to do is we're going to go and build a bunch of nodes that don't exist when a node when a box gets created, but they are properly linked together. This button is linked to this piston, but when a player enters the box, this button and this piston will not exist. This is how it looks in detail. As you can see, there's the same button here and a piston that are linked. But, if they are removed, we can recreate the whole situation by using node creators. Okay, so how does it work? Well, first of all, we want to create the end result. So let's just go and put down couple of blocks to put some stuff on. Later we'll place the node creators here underneath. Now we need a button. That's simple. We need a piston. Got one right here. And we need to link them. Click. Right click. Now we've got a link set. Let's test it. That looks good. Now we can remove these pedestals that we quickly needed. And I can go and create the node creators for both the button and the piston. Everybody knows that's just left clicking and then placing it directly underneath. Left clicking, now making a piston creator and putting it underneath. Obviously, we need to activate these two, so I'm using a simple button to go and create this, which I now need to link to both this one and to this one. That's a right click on this one too, so left click. Right click, right click. Okay, so now I've linked this button to both the two node creators. You can see that in the text that appears in the top left of the screen with the reveal tool. This one will create a mech button at distance zero, and this one will create a piston at distance zero. Okay, now I can delete this one and remove this one. I can save the box and exit, and as the player walks into this box and pushes the button, they'll both get created. And they are functional. Okay, now everybody knows that you can modify the distance of these buttons. So what happens if I modify the distance of the button creator here? Let's delete it. Let's delete it. I don't need this one anymore. So let's move this. But let's go and modify the distance of this node creator and this node creator. Set it to one. Guess what happens when I push the button? It is created one distance further. Do you think it still works? Indeed it does. The distance and the mech link, the distance is, apt, is relative and the mech link is relative too. So you can just move this up a couple of times. Set it to five. Set this one to five with left clicks. And now we're obviously going to get one there in the air. Does it still work? Yes, it still works. So that's a very simple explanation of how to use mech links and node creators. So keep in mind that node creators will retain all the information that's stored in the node and that includes the link itself. The, the links are relative, so they are only within your box and they will always be the same vector, so to speak. And that will allow you to create very complex mechanics that appear during the player box. Thanks for watching.